All right, I wanted to show you how to write a for loop. So I have a integer right here, num, which is a value of one, and I want to print the numbers from one to 10. So I first do a for loop with having the word four. And then inside of my parentheses, I have three different things. First thing is I can do initialization. So I could do a num equal to one if I wanted, if it wasn't already initialized. But let's go ahead and initialize it. And then I have my conditional test. So if num is less than or equal to 10, then I'm going to run my statement. So num plus plus. This is what my incrementing thing is. And then I, inside these curly braces, I can decide what I'm going to do each time I go through the loop. In this case, it's going to be standard C out. Standard library C out, and I'm going to print the number num, and then I'm going to do a, an end line right there. All right, so I go ahead and run this, and let's see what happens. So I run the code, and it prints the numbers from 1 to 10. 1 all the way down to 10, and it prints them out. So this is how you do it. Um, one thing to keep in mind is for loops also have the extra ability. If I'm not going to be using the number num or the integer num, I can actually declare it inside here and then remove this one up here and it will still work just fine. So I'll go ahead and run it and it runs from one to 10. Now remember this integer num is now only existing inside of this for loop. And once you're outside the for loop, it's gone. So there you go. That's how to write a for loop.